Well, hi friends. It's been a little while since we've really put up a vlog and um, that is in large part due to my lack of energy and um, just trying to take care of myself and focusing on, you know, getting healthy and yeah. Um, I think I've been trying to hide or push away a lot of feelings that I'm feeling. I feel like maybe I've been really trying to not think about our miscarriage and not think about our fertility treatment, not think about our journey, not think about just everything that we've been through or that we're going through. Um, and it's all kind of catching up to me. Um, I can't seem to find any energy to do anything anymore. I can't seem to get out of bed like I need to to function like a normal person. I don't know if it's depression. It's um, it's 4 p.m. on Sunday. I broke down just a few, like 15 minutes before needing to leave for church. And so we stayed home. I slept the rest of the time and I just woke up. And I just, my dog stayed with me and just slept next to me. But I can't keep doing this. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm not okay. Um, I don't have any energy. I don't have... I... I'm not enjoying life like I need to be. Or like I should be. I've been breaking down a little bit more often. But I feel like I'm more together. I don't know. Like it's such a weird, it's such a weird, weird um spot that I'm in right now. Hi, sweetie. Oh, mom is okay. It's such a weird spot. Brian's birthday was last Friday, and uh, all I could think about was that, and all I could think about was how far along I would be, and how he would be a daddy, and. No, I'm not giving him that. No. <laughs> and our anniversary is in two days. <laughs> and we've just gone through my whole ovulation, the whole OPK test, whatever. So we have all the sticks and we tried tracking and so we've tried naturally and we'll see how that goes. And I just feel like I'm not okay. And I know it's okay to not be okay. I've said that a hundred times, right? That's why I'm sharing it. That's why I'm sharing it. Like, obviously, if I wasn't okay not being okay, I wouldn't share it on YouTube or on Instagram or on Facebook or with everybody that I don't know or that I know. I know it's okay to not be okay. I know it's okay to grieve and to cry and to be upset and, and to feel it because it is a, I don't know it. I just don't know what my heart is feeling anymore. It's so numb, yet it's not at the same time. I, uh, <laughs> I just <laughs> I don't know what to do I don't know what to do because I can't keep doing this I can't keep I can't keep doing this and I've been on anxiety medication before, I've been on depression medication before, and all it really does to me is makes me feel like um, numb and kind of floating a little bit. And I don't know if that's a good thing to feel right now. Maybe it is, and maybe that's what I need. I have no problem with anybody being on some kind of medication to stabilize them. And of course, I think it's totally normal to feel that and to go through that after a miscarriage or during fertility treatment and during any kind of loss, during any kind of hard time in your life, really, right? I just want to fix it, you know? And I just want to fix it quick. I want to be able to 
I want to know what I need to do. So if you have any advice, please comment below because I don't know what to do. One of the things I'm going to try doing is to change my diet this week. I'm going to change my diet. I'm going to try setting an alarm so I get up in the morning or else I don't even try to get up. The only reason I get up in the morning is for my dog. I'm going to try exercising and hopefully that helps with any depression that I have. I'm going to try serving other people and focusing on what I can do to help others. That makes it kind of hard when you have zero energy and you can't do anything and when you're just not happy. Like it's so sad to just like you're just going with the emotions of everything of just life and you just don't feel the same the same way you know but i'm not okay and i'm realizing that i'm not okay and it's okay to not be okay and it's okay to share it it's only been two months you guys it's only been two months is it weird that thinking about it makes me like physically sick it makes you want to throw up you know <laughs> I don't know what to do. Uh, sad. Uh. Life is hard. Infertility is hard. Miscarriage is hard. Trials in life are hard. Grieving is hard. Doesn't matter which kind of trial you're going through, we're all going through different things. But it's hard, and it's okay to share the hard times as well as the good. And it's okay to need to lean on other people. I just can't believe that it's all real, you know? It's like it's it's really real. I'm going to try to upload more videos. Um, this is just an update on where we are. I've been struggling, which is why we haven't been uploading videos as often. I've been keeping myself really busy with lip sense and selling lip sense and my team and everything else. And and my husband's birthday and and um just focusing on my health and taking care of me but clearly i've neglected i've neglected myself in in some way or another because i i didn't even know that i was really really still struggling and uh, i guess it's really normal i guess it's really normal like am i depressed like i don't know what i don't know what's going on with me and i told brian i told brian today i said brian something is wrong like I'm not okay and that's okay right but I still want to be able to do the everyday normal things that I do that I need to do that I want to do but it's hard right now it's really hard I'm scared I'm scared for the future I'm scared to know what's going to happen I'm scared to go through another treatment cycle and for it not to work out I'm scared to go through another miscarriage letting myself feel it a little bit more will be good Um. yeah anyway Right now I feel sick. I feel physically sick and I'm worried that I'm start gaining weight because one of the things I've told my husband is when I'm sad, I eat. When I'm happy, you can tell because I don't gain weight. Well, right now I feel like I'm gaining a little bit of weight. And so that's making me sad. That's making me have body image issues. <laughs> Why does that have to be so hard? Being a woman is hard. Thanks for your guys' support and for your prayers and for everything, for following us. We are so dang grateful. Anyway, we love you guys. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Um, and uh, if you want to follow us on Instagram, if you're not yet, it's at Carissa Barzi. If you want to follow my lip sense page, it's at Kisses by Carissa on Facebook and on Instagram. Um, we're very grateful for you and we're hoping for the best with everything so i will put up more videos this week and um let you guys stay tuned on how i'm doing okay all right toodles